everyone, welcome back to Creative Craft. Tony, how are you? I'm good, thank you. I tell you what, that show was energetically loud just now, wasn't it? <laughs> Just a bit, I was like, whoa. He's going out there waiting for the bus to arrive, not realising it was also for story. <laughs> but, but nevertheless, um, wow, what a show, Tony. Brand, you've really treated with a pick and mix here, but brand new and exclusive embossing folders. And I feel like with your embossing folders, you could just purely run it through and have the embossing folder like do the talking, be the statement, be the topper, if you like, or it can complement another topper. Yeah, absolutely. So they're that good, should we say, 3D on a whole new level that you're going to get that embossed detail on there. And then when you create your cards, you're going to need hardly nothing else to create a most, you know, mantle pleasers or creative cards. So I always find that embossing folders, they're indestructive, really. You can't really damage them. <laughs> yeah. um, as long as you don't put any heat on them, you're absolutely fine. Um, they're inexpensive as well. That's why you've got the fabulous pick and mix. So you can pick the ones that you want rather than me have to try and guess which ones yeah. you're all going to absolutely love. And you're going to be able to just run them through and as clean as simple cards or white if you want to, or equally if you want to do... I have been the ambassador of the brush for about five years, pick up that brush and yes, watercolour them. So our embossing folders, we call them our watercolour embossing folders because we like to paint them. But equally, technique wise, add the ink, spray, use all of the techniques, sand yeah. back if you want to, add the ink, add the texture, gilding waxes, all of the good stuff. And in an earlier show, I sort of like took you back to basics with embossing folders mm -hmm. and all of the lovely techniques that I've, been, I've seen since I started crafting many years ago. You know, embossing folders have been around for donkeys, haven't they? Um, it's just in recent years that they've been stepped up and stepped up and stepped up. And I'm sure in the up and coming months and years, these are going to get even better, even deeper, you know, and you're going to get some lovely affordable elements in your stash that are going to use all the time. Well, listen, you can get them individually. There are six new ones on the show. They are $9.99 each. And if you only want one, absolutely go for one. But... If you want more than one, you absolutely go for the pick and mix. Because after all, you buy any three. This is the box in, of which in that first show, 20% of the stock had gone for 13.49 in the club. So you save your PMP anyway if you're um, a non-club member. Of course, even more uh, by being in the club down to 26. Sorry, uh, even less. Oops. Oh, <laughs> set it up. Uh, for you, 12.14 on Flex. You pay by being in the club. So it's 7.44197. Talk to me then, it makes them um, every embossing folder just over eight pounds rather than nine ninety nine, which is cracking value. Boxed in, actually you were saying this is one of your favourites. Yeah, what you'll find with our embossing folders done is they look amazing front and back. And when I run them through I'll show you. Yep. So you get sort of one texture, one side, so you've got double double option really because one side is equally as beautiful as the back side mm -hmm. as well. So you can use them in so many like rise and falls in your cards, ink through texture, they're just an incredible piece of kit that everybody needs to have in their stash. You know, and as long as you've got that lovely die cutting machine, just change out your mats, you're going to be um, ready and set to go. So it doesn't matter what machines you have. If you find your cards cracking, I uh, always say this on air because yeah. I think I didn't know this until I spoke to Pete, but Pete from Sizzix said to me, Tony, spray the card. It's fine. Spray the like, card, it's cracking when I put it through my big shot. He's like, spray the card. <gasps> Spray it with stuff. water, he's amazing. amazing. And I went to one of his workshops when I first started crafting about 14 years ago. And he remembered me. Of course he did, I absolutely. He's that kind of guy. I'm like a fine wine, though. I get better with age, Pete. He will like to start laughing. How long ago was the workshop? Well, 14 years. Was it? Yeah, a long, long time ago. So, um, uh, so he says, spray it with water. And I'm like, well, that just makes sense. Why didn't I just do that? But anyway, it breaks down the fibres, hmm. so you can run it through your machine and you get that little bit of aid. It just stops that card from cracking because each machine is different. Everybody's pressures are different. They all cut dies, but with relation yeah. to... And these are 3D. These are the best you can absolutely buy. So just make sure you spray the card if they crack. Well, if we can get ahead of us, if you want to get the blossom brush, uh, the wicker basket. Cause you're, um, but interestingly, Tony's favourite is the boxing we just saw. The one in my hand right now is your favourite at home, uh, which is the geometric leaves. 40% have gone. I paused on this one because I'm, I'm, I'm looking at the back to make sure you can see the embossing. Is this from it as well? Yes, yeah, so just I'm going to do this one as a similar demo you and I've just cut it out. Well, I haven't actually, not on that one. I'm going to cut it out on my Karen. demo, but that one's Karen's. So think about, we just launched Christmas, all of that lovely Christmas foliage, your yep. Christmas pins, pop them in. Think about bright reds for poinsettias and things like that. You know, don't just think, oh, it's a white flower. Add the colour, add the texture, be creative with them because honestly, they're going to give you longevity and Beautiful, you get a yeah. lot of money, you get a lot of product for your money here. Yeah, absolutely. You know, it's not just, it doesn't put anything in a box, it covers the whole sort of plethora of craft. I mean, look at that. Individually, they are all individual item numbers, by the way. So, for example, if you want the previous one, the geometric leaves, 240227. If you're going to go for more than one, as in the pick and mix, you go for the item number on the big 
big screen, big part screen, left hand side of your screen, uh, 744197. It'd be the same price if you put one or two in there, so make sure we put three. This rose is a really, it's called, well, it's called lollipops, which is beautiful, but you get the idea why in yeah. prep we were like, oh, they're like beautiful roses, don't they, as well? There could be so many things. I yeah. think everybody's eye is going to tell a different story, and I love anything that's going to sort of chop up and change the industry in relation to craft. So we see lo lollipops, we see vernaculous flowers, we see roses. Um, you know, we just see like sketches and scribbles, yeah, yeah, yeah. fun kit if you want them to be Ooh. as well. So don't, you know, don't. What's that being treated with? That's Not by got Paul. mica powder and embossing powder sprinkled on. Wow. That's just gorgeous. It's impressive, isn't it? So that one is called Lollipops. You yeah. wonder if that one's called Lollipops. And that's stamped in the show. I will be oh using yeah. it in my demo. Perfect. There we go. You see the whole set of balloons. We'll give you those details as we're going through. Directly below there. <laughs> I know you went for the sun. Do you want to go somewhere else? That's all right. I'll just go in here. I don't mind. That's fine. Blossom all right, bunch. Blossom, blossom bunch. Uh, which individually is the most popular, <laughs> <laughs> which is uh, amazing, isn't it? Oh, I love that with them on the screen there. Like using it as almost like a guide for watercolour. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, our watercolour embossing folders started out as mini florals. We had some in the corner, some on the edge, some in the middle. We were not afraid of like open spaces on embossing folders. That gives you the capability to add sentiments and toppers and things like mm -hmm. that. So this one is a little bit different. However, you still get two florals because I have to have florals because that's what I'm about. Um, but you have the backgrounds as well in there as well. It's totally, totally different. I mean, that is um, your pearl, wow. pearl powders. Yeah. You know, look at that. It's just absolutely stunning. I and if you do batch making, put a lot of them through your machine and do them with different mediums, you're going to end up with different cards well, every single We're going to prove that exact point, aren't we? Because talking about like, uh, I'll ask you about, about pearl, uh, pearl, um, <laughs> Powders is the word I was trying to say with your folders. <laughs> I said folders instead. But, uh, by the way, we've got the wow powders on the show as well, which I know you're going to be interested in. Um, but then I know you're just going to do it just like purely just on white, Absolutely. either side. I'm just well. going to show you on white because I think white shows better on TV. But I'd and it shows you how incredible they are as well. But I do encourage try the different techniques because honestly, the wow factor as soon as you add a little bit of ink or pick up that brush yep. and paint them absolutely stunning so that is your blossom bunch three two one three nine six bottom of the screen individually if you want to get hold of it but we continue on your fifth option is your wicker basket i know adam was really enjoying this earlier on and actually how interesting is has it been used as like is this sea waves or yeah, fields so or yeah, it's been broken into so it looks like waves in water but you can equally do sort of like a half and behind Ooh, sorry that's got like lots of powders and sprays on there as well. You can see it, can't you? Can just hopefully you can see it anyway. So you can see the texture. Cool, don't think it? about left to right. Think horizontal, yep. vertical. Don't put yourself in that sort of box. Play around. Some of like this card here. Just go. I know we're going back, but That's just right. use maybe a corner of the embossing Ooh, folder. Yeah, so yeah, rather absolutely. than I thinking, you. Do you know, I have to use the whole piece. Just use like one element of it. Chop it into various types of shapes and pop them on. You know, you, you, it's. You are the creator of your own cards. There are simply no rules. Really, really fun to do. So that's your uh, wicker basket on the bottom of the screen individually. 286831. Uh, that's in the lead on this show. It keeps chopping and changing. This is the lead on this show. My <laughs> favourite one is the sunflower. I think the first thing I said about this show when we just started now was the embossing folder can just be the topper, if you like. Oh, absolutely. And the topper I think, I don't know if you agree, is the sort of thing that catches your eye first of all. Maybe it's the thing you read first absolutely. or you, you see first. But the embossing folder to do so as a guide for colouring or something Petrus to feel. Yeah, and in my first demo, you saw me cut it out twice, twist the design, put some pads behind and add gold gilding. Wax on top gives that real wow factor. Then you can absolutely do that. Take your brush, paint them, add your gel pens. No line water colouring, so no edge. But if you feel it, yeah, it's so... So cool! It's just well, three dollars though. Like on a new level. The pollen is raised, and then these leaves are raised slightly less than that, and then the the three D element of layers and layers and layers going through. You'll certainly see it when you get home. Ooh. And then just one with a touch. That's just an ink pad brushed over the top, very very lightly, just catching the rise and fall. So if you're thinking, do you know, I'm a newbie to craft. <gasps> I'm a newbie to craft. I really don't want to do all of the cards that are a little bit overwhelming. I want to start basic. Then you can absolutely start basic. And that one is from Paul. So that one's it's Paul. Yep. That's On this show, because you are choosing any three after all, in the lead at the moment are, remind me, Laura, Wicker <gasps> Basket, which is this one here, the <gasps> Lollipop, which is this one here. Let me pop this sunflower it's changed, down. It's changing. Oh, it does. It's crazy, what was the other one, team? Geometric. Geometric, thank you. So it's the geometric. That is what is in lead at the mo. Wicker basket, the lollipops or the roses, as I keep calling them. 
and also your geometrics. And we've put the pick and mix on as well because, like I said earlier, I, I prefer it if you guys pick <laughs> rather yeah, yeah, than yeah. me put you in a box. And it's because sometimes when we put collections together, you might like two and not like the third. Yeah. So this pick and mix option gives you the capability to pick the ones you absolutely love. So you know you're going to use them. I'm not going to be fearful. We're going to get put in a drawer and get put away for the rest of your life. They have the fabulous QR code on the back of each embossing folder. Always remember that. So we have our own digital channel where yes, you can go and catch all of the inspiration where I showcase all of the products that I bring to you here at Creation Craft. There are now over 1,118 videos of products we've brought to you here. We've been doing the QR code, as you know, Indeed, yeah. for, for years. It's hard work, but I do it because I want you to use the products that you buy from me time and time again. It's an updating QR code as well, which means you might scan it Monday, it'll have one video, you might scan it in a month's time and it'll have four because I've used it in shows. Yeah, this is really exciting. A lot of you are going for all six. If you're going for all six, I understand maybe you're thinking, right, I'm going to go for the three in the pick and mix and I'll go for three individuals. I get you doing that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Order, get all six into your basket, and you're going for two pick and mixes. Therefore, it'll be 24, 28 on FlexiPay today and in the next six months, but one PMP. One PMP of only 2.99 and the same item number, 177197. If you've never seen Tony's embossing uh, folders, they are different. They are 3D. They're beautiful designs. Stay tuned. Loads of live demonstrations on the way. But I know so many of you are going for the wow powders as well. These ones have kind of got your name all over them These as well. are a bit fancy. These are dead fancy. <laughs> That's exactly what they are. So this is our third launch. So we did first Christmas and yep. now this one. So this one is Summer Vibes. So basically you get um, a, like a limey zesty green. You get a lilac-y purpley colour and you get the pretty in pink. So these are very uplifting, very wow. summery. You can use them all year round if you want to. And these give a beautiful subtle subtle hint and if you see on that craft colored card behind there yep. they give you like a Ooh. like it's really it's really they've got a clear undertone in there so they work incredible on colored cardstock but equally you can use them in whites as well you can use a salt and pepper technique where you sprinkle it on top if you okay. want to it's just they're just really really beautiful i know a lot of you are collecting my wow powders um and i'm absolutely overjoyed and over the moon that wow and myself are now collaborating and marion is a good friend of mine who also comes here yeah, yeah, yeah. and so you know i like yeah i'll put my name on the colors but do i get to work with marion so do i get to work with marion like, yes yeah, i do yeah. I'm like, i'll do it then <laughs> here we go Can't you can see win. the board here in this one by elaine uh, i think the difference with embossing folders or nowhere near your embossing folders could be going anywhere you wish to do uh, there are your three tones yeah they're the new ones the new ones and then you see a card here so uh, with that a, is with um, a box mirror card um Ooh. mirror card with um sticky ink pad and the pink on yeah oh no pink yeah yeah you see that isn't it funny when so Tony looks cool. at it it looks silver doesn't it or yeah. purpley and the pinks come through yeah it's cool isn't it so so good wow and then the other sorry i'm not talking about the other one yet you can talk about the other one right now if you wish well i'll give you the item number for this one uh <laughs> brand new today the summer sun three eight five one eight seven twenty five percent of the stock has gone it's a trio of shows by the way that says one more in the morning but of course you can check out your basket tonight before you go to bed then it's on its way for you half the stock of the next one tony so this Sorry, one's back in stock this okay. is the first ones we brought to you so these are like a rosy gold color you get um, the first one, which is like just, which one are you doing first? That one? I don't know, which one do you want to do any, first? Any? Just, just one of them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, hmm, which hand should so I that use one's this time? Which one? White, fra white fragmented pieces in there, so you get a marble effect. Okay. Or uh, if you love the. This the one's previous. sparkle. Oh, wow. I mean. You can see why it's sold out loads. This is the third time we've brought this back, you know. It's crazy, isn't it? So that's uh, the sparkly one. I will never get bored of that. That's why we tune into creating craft. That's why we order craft products. We want that at home, don't we? Absolutely. Beautiful. And the final one. And then the last one is just like a normal embossing powder. So if you're wanting absolutely crisp, clean lines, this is the one to use. If you don't want the sparkle and you don't want the texture, just use but this just one. Give, but gives you a bit of dimension to it, doesn't Absolutely. it? It's like yeah. a pearly finish, this one. Yeah, so you yeah. get like a pearl, a texture and a glitter all in one. All same colour undertone, all a rosy gold colour. Perfect for your Christmas cards. Perfect for any time of the year. God Absolutely is stunning. Stunning else, isn't it? Wow. That's it's like you just opened a treasure chest, hasn't we it? We love like sparkle, don't we? Some different ideas in the back of there. Uh, nearly 60% have sold out and gone. So bravo, everybody. Uh, 585 on Flexi Pay. You've seen the difference it makes just on a Tony stamp. Uh, 59239. 592235. Oh, I'll get them in, Tony. It's been a while. It's been a while. I think I'm new. One day I'll get it. Uh, 585 <laughs> on Flexi Pay. Now, these stamps were actually the first product that I looked at um, when I knew I was doing a show with you. I think you do such 
big, bold stamps. And they are a big stamp, aren't they? With a Eureka or, you know, whatever you've got, uh, can be really useful. And much like the embossing folder, this can frame up a smaller sentiment, could frame around the top or be the top. Absolutely. So these are your A5 ones. These are sort of like a slim liney design. So if you like to do your stretch cards or your elongated cards, mm -hmm. then this is going, this has totally got you covered. Large open spaces for your colouring. Now, this is the third time we've brought you this back. We've never put them together like this. And okay. I felt like I wanted these in the show because they work beautifully on top of your embossing folders. So they complement the back, the, um, square embossing folders so if you're into a little bit of colouring and things yeah. like that it's going to look amazing you can create gatefold cards it's just a lovely lovely mix now this is the last time probably these will be back i won't be ordering these ones again um just a lovely lovely set you've, you've seen these pop up on so many cards yeah. from our lovely design team well, actually the buttercup ones on this side here let me show you a sample or two because we can see the blossom bunch so that just shows you that you've got two quite busy items going on on one card yeah. there but one's been pushed right back to give you an accent so it's not the focal and then one's been brought right to the foreground and that geometric and then vellum okay. followed on to vellum and then onto the geometric leaf if you want to and then the last one is on that lovely lovely craft and the em and the embossing on there is beautiful and then you've got that lovely sort of like sweet pea corn element on there just a lovely lovely set if you look at this thinking i would love a whole host of cardstock with <laughs> that being the pattern on it you can make it absolutely, absolutely. you can have as much of this and as it you looks want. gorgeous on parchment or vellum i bet it does i bet it does and then the, the shading and the ideas and the buttercups really beautiful but you also get the sweet pea side of things as well 26.99 you've got nine pounds saving there uh, by being in the club of course three six zero nine four seven there are other stamps that are on the show that we promised we would show you uh, for example we've got the summer heights uh, and I think we're going to see the hot air balloon things later on. Uh, 14 stamps in there and six dies. Oh, this is our hot, well, hot air balloon. Yeah, I'm going to use a hot air balloon. This one, the, I loved launching this one. It was a proper happy show because it's summer, it's exciting, it's got kites in there, it's got a hot air balloon with some beautiful flowers on it. So I am going to incorporate this one into a demo as well. Oh, we saw the kites with the um, basket wings, yeah, didn't we? Yeah, I didn't get yep. a chance earlier. I do apologise, it was a little bit frantic, but I will do it in this one. Okay, I'll talk quicker if that's even possible. 46961 <laughs> uh, to get hold of. Of yours, and you've got three flexies. So for under twenty pounds, I'm looking at the red box, nineteen forty-nine uh, for you. Um, there are more dies on the show. Your lovables. I know you've found them already. Seven dies in here. Now this is a little bit different for you. I don't often see you doing things like this. Yeah. So these are sort of like a nesting. These are th these are totally different. You've probably never seen anything like these before. So basically, they're like a nesting die but they don't cut out of the page. Can you see on the card blank on the front there, it cuts into the page and then you raise the sides of the okay. hearts. So it gives you sort of like a three dimensional element on the card. And then you can pop your sentiments, your focal points, your washi tape animals, your, your florals if you want to. Just really, really different. These absolutely flew. I'm gonna do some more. I'm gonna do some stars. I'm gonna do some moons. I'm gonna oh, really go to town cool. with these. Well, whilst we've got really the discount, yeah, whilst we've got a special price tonight, I know we're not gonna see de demonstrate them tonight, but they're in stock. If you missed them first time around, didn't know they existed. 1049, it's on Flexi Pay. 996983. We've talked embossing folders, stamps, dies. There's also stencils on the show. So if you want to get your beautiful background collection. Oh, we get all five, Tony. Yeah, this was. So these were with summer heights. So the poppies was to create perspective with the hot air balloons, like it was going over a poppy field. Then we have the honeycomb, which looks like lightning. Then we That's have cool, the um, numbers, which looks like digital rain. I saw some samples over there with the numbers. Yeah. Then appearing. we have the halo, Keep which looks Tony like sun shining through clouds and gives you that halo rainbow. And then you get the super oversized rainbows on there. So these all work beautifully <gasps> with summer heights. Here it is. But equally, if you want to stencil through and then run an embossing folder on top, just think about the different sort of elements that you're going to be able to create with them because they're really going to work across the board. And that's your digital rain. How cool is that? In about only a little bit, you yeah, left some space for the embossing folder. Touch it. It's just to add to get rid of the white, the blank space at the back. These sort of stencils add just that touch of elegance, really, really lovely. Right, hang on. Oh, he's keeping it tidy, he's keeping it all tidy. He's keeping it tidy house. <laughs> Crates and Crafts, best ever selling stamping platform is in front of your eyes right now. I was using this yesterday uh, with Sarah and Funky Fossil, uh, she yeah. had hers. Many others have it as well. Uh, Laura Produce has got one as well. 058619. I say stamping platform, it's multiple uses. It is. So, launched in 2017, award winning 
sold a lot. Yeah. <laughs> we sold a lot. Um, check out, I don't know if the reviews carried forward from old place to this place. Uh, they didn't. Okay, that's fine. So basically, um, in here you get a compact sort of station that's going to enable you to do multiple, multiple craft options. Yep. You're going to be able to do your stamping. So if you are, use your clear stamp, leave the mat in. If you use red and grey rubber stamps, take the mat out. There we go. The depth is such that you can stamp onto three and four mil MDF. Mm -hmm. So all the home decor, the frames, the pictures, the Christmas embellishments that we have to stamp, that you want to stamp onto, they can fit in there as well. You have the wells across the top and the side because that's how it started, painting on the go, ambassador of picking up that brush, hence why I love uh, Matthew Palmer. Yep. And then we have that brush across the base, so you've got a brush in there, the magnets in there. If you're wanting to craft on the go at the caravan, you don't want to take your cumbersome scoreboards and you don't want to take all of the elements. Guess what? We've got a scoreboard in there. It also turns over to be a box template and an envelope maker as well. So if you want to make your own envelopes while you're out and about as well, you can absolutely <coughs> do that. The yep. door on the front has all the sizes on, card blank sizes. You have the cross hair centers. So if you want to stamp into the centers of the cards as well. If you want to put your beads in here, and pop an elastic band around so you can seed bead on it. Yeah, yeah. If you want to do your flower shaping on the back side because it's soft, you can absolutely do that. If you want to use the screen at the front as a messy mat, you can do that. It, wipe it wipes clean as long as I it's like not alcohol inked. Hand modeling is quite well. And if you want to look after your project product because it is a considered purchase, we have the amazing clutch bag to um, look after what you've purchased. You can kind of tell why. You will never buy another one. Yep, it is crazy. Unless you want to, because one gets mucky, because I know what crafters are like, <laughs> some have <laughs> got, got two and three, but equally it's absolutely an amazing station that you will have on your work surface. It won't get put in a drawer because one of the elements don't work. They all work really, really well. There we Best go. Best thing ever. Best ever selling units wise. Best ever selling. So clearly it's hugely popular since its induction in 2017. And you've got on three flex pay if you wish, 1650. That is all to get your Eureka. That's flexi pay, of course. Uh, now, to quickly remind you of that pick and mix of the embossing folds, it's our first demonstration. Uh, choose any three then. You've got six new ones to pick one though. Uh, the lollipops, like the roses. Geometric leaves is now in the lead. The oh. boxed in blossom bunch, wicker basket, and sunflowers. Put four in your basket. Three, sorry, three in your basket. If you put one, it's 26.97. Put three, it's 26.97. Even more off if you're in the club. If you only want one, or maybe you're ordering three, and you think, you know what, mum would love one of those. The sunflower, for example, they've got individual item numbers for them individually. Uh, Lollipop is now busiest individually. Right. Uh, but they are eight ninety nine each by being in the club. Uh, but 744-197 is your brand new and exclusive launch. Uh, at the earliest show, this show, and then one more in the morning at 8 a.m. to guarantee that price. Which one would you like to start on? Please? Let's start with the busiest, the lollipop. Okay. Is that okay? So it looks like roses, flowers, vernaculus flowers as well. Um, so basically, you'll just get your embossing folder. When you open it up, there's a rise and a fall. There is no right or wrong way, really. But what I will say to you is, when you do your inky techniques, do both sides, and then you can decide at the end which one you want to do. So I'm just going to take some regular white cardstock. Now, I don't have to spray this. It doesn't crack my cards. My machine doesn't crack my cards, but different pressures on different machines, you may have to spray just a light mist with some water um, and just run it through the machine to stop any cracking. They are 3D. Uh, 3D like no other, and you're going to get that high sort of um, high rise look on these as well. Let me just line this up. Mm -hmm. So I'm just using my machine, but use the machine you have at home. They work in all machines. I haven't Super done a show with you, I think. Did you, when you it's been a long time. Yeah. It's been a long time machine. coming, hasn't it? I know it's sold out of the machine. Well, well done, everybody. Yeah, it'll be quick. It's back, though. It's coming back. Don't worry. Hope so. Hope so. There's not many items we don't restock now because the demand is. Right, I'll pass it to you and you can show front and back. Oh, which one? I was about to say which one does show first. There's doesn't both. Matter, does it? It's both. Both nice. Oh so that's, that's the um, lollipops. The lollipop, that's how quick it can be. I hope you can see that. It's easier to so see. That's the back, is it? It's a little bit di yeah, I think it is actually. That's the back. Yeah, there you go. See, comes together quickly. <laughs> but not forgetting, if you want to ink it up, uh, for example, put your gilding waxes or embossing powders, whatever you fancy. But quite right, the back is a different look, isn't it? It's yeah. another look. So if you'd have inked the embossing folder, the colour would have gone into those recesses yeah. and you'd have had an inky sort of texture within. Beautiful. There so we go. That, that is the uh, lollipop. What should we do next? Wicker basket. Wicker basket. Right, let me get a sample. Let's run this one through. Just don't leave me on my own. No, no. Keep going, keep going. Crank, 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 crank. Go for it, go for it. Okay. So let's show you this one. So this one is that lovely. 
ready. God, just out the you know what, producer Laura's making a very good point saying you could get loads Why of samples. Why don't you just bring one. them all? No, I'm going to get my steps up and keep dashing away. That's what I'll do. One, one, one. So I go to the shop for one item every single time. Here we go. That wicked, oh, it's almost like a third eye, isn't it? Like a magic Ooh. eye effect. Yeah, do you see the meadows? Do you see the waves? Or, as you were seeing, uh, whichever which way around you wish to put it, but really very, very cool. Okay, uh, there's the wicker basket. What do you fancy? All the, um, I was about to say pinwheel. No. Geometric <laughs> leaves. <Wow. laughs> which one should I get? This is, I don't know which one's my favourite. Well, you said box in to start with, but has it changed? Is it this one now? I don't know. I don't know. I like them all. Well, it's a good job. Thank goodness I pick a mix. Then. Exactly. Thank goodness you pick a mix. I get the idea. I get why we love the embossed side of things. I know, but look at that. But actually, just yeah. Just look at that. That's just another level, isn't it? Look at that. That's how deep it is. Nearly 60%. Sold oh. out, gone from 40 plus to 60. My eyes are so bad. Can you see? Can people see that? I hope so. Yeah, I hope so. Okay. Well, unless I'm seeing things. Okay. There we go. Halfway through. This is a quick. And you know what? If you're batch, we use these to make and sell, right? Absolutely. That's what I was saying to you earlier. Get a load of cardstock, yeah. different colours, run them through, all different. If you don't want to do them in uh, inky techniques, you just coloured cardstock. They yeah. look incredible. Get them out, and then all you've got to do is add some toppers. I'm doing boxing. Okay. okay. What about now this from? is really okay. different. <laughs> oh, this I one. really like this one. It looks like a posh wall. Posh wall, like your walls. No, oh, I wish. Your walls on the farm. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. <gasps> That's a back. We should. Excuse the income there, because I did an inky technique earlier, but I think you get the idea. That is. Oh wow. Right, wait, wait till we show you what other side. Turn it over, Dan, turn it over. Done it, look at ah! that. Wow. <laughs> How Again, are you going to decide? Again, adding ink and thing, whatever you fancy. That's <laughs> mad, absolutely mad. It's a bit like, it's, um, it's a bit weird to see on the eye, isn't it? It looks like it's moving. Yeah. It's a bit weird, but it's gorgeous. Love it. Right, next. Was this the one? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Pause, 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 pause. pause, pause, pause Where pause. was the one with the, um, here we go. Yeah, then when you put mirrored cardstock into the mix, and also your, and your, your powders. powders. By the way, if you love these embossing <laughs> powders, I know we're in the middle of our demonstration. These are going absolutely wild. The new trio. In fact, no way. Pardon? Limited. How did we get from? You said the pink ones. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I nearly had that. I yeah. Like, like that is cannot possibly. It's the possibly. other ones. Well, I can't grab all of those, team. Or well, can there's I? no way all of them sold out. No. <laughs> all right, here we go. I suppose they, they, cause they said the know. pink ones, and there's a pink one in that. But these ones, which I get, I get why they're, I get why they're pinky. Here we go. Don't spill it. But what if I do? Oh, nice. anyway. Um, ninety percent of this one. 90% of this one has gone. I get where you were calling it. Yeah, anyway, 90% has gone. 5, 9, 2, oh 2, dear. 3, 5. I went from half to 90. 90. Right, you can put this back. Oh, I've got the sunflower stuck in it, Tony. Don't, don't worry, I'll, I'll save it for you. Hang on. Calm. Do you want to do, the, do, you do the, the bendy wobble? Are you getting a do sample? Still? If I walk back slowly, right, you've got to do you it. I'll show you this one on overhead if you want me to. Yeah, go for it. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Ta-da! <laughs> Hopefully they'll, can you see that? Yeah, of course you can. And then you've got your obviously your debuff side. It's not ink in there. It's it's the, the dark there. areas are shadow. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? I mean, I love it. And now I would, if I'd done this on watercolor card, I'd be getting my watercolors out, and I would be sitting for an hour yeah. and just painting it and just having fun. How beautiful! Forget about the world outside. Uh, now I've brought two cards over. Thank you, Tony. Um, that I don't know if you got to see before because they're on the display. But again, adding up. Is that the way around? Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. That's right. Um, uh, you can see the glitters on one, or as you've just said. No line. You might have. But it's there. Yeah, it is there. It's gorgeous. How beautiful now. is that? So, that one is, of course, your sunflower blossom bunch. Yep. Next, okay. class on. one, then we get into demo. Okay. Are these not demos, Tony? No. I like to do demos, Dan. <laughs> no. I like to do demos. I'm not a, you could do this, you could do that. 
the cake. But I am doing a, you could do this, you could do that right now, so. <laughs> but I am going to demo, I do have demos. I like my demos. It's the best bit. It's the best bit. Blossom Bunch, which I think I really struggled to say a little bit. <laughs> Blossom Bunch. We need to get that cut back as well. Can you not see I it? I know, I like, hide it, like, hands over, hands over. Yeah, do you want to show it? Yeah, sure. Oh, you know what? I think my view of the back is even better. Yeah. That's the front. Oh, <laughs> when you listen to it. Yeah, no, you're not really. Yeah, we're almost repeating what they're saying. That's the back. Oh. Oh, metal carvings are saying in my ear. These are different samples showing how beautiful they are looking. Oh, is this a little bit of Make the building wax. waxes, whichever way around you wish to put them? But they're divine, aren't they? Or I think I got this sample from earlier on when you killed them in. Oh, Tony D. Mirror board with black ink on top. Wow. That is a showstopper. You're even seeing it I going through the, <laughs> the grey on the back. That's going in my basket. Straight in You're my basket. We're hearing you. it in our ear. <laughs> okay, which three are you going for? That is the Blossom Bunch. Congratulations, <laughs> everybody. And then you've got all six. And then if I just pop these down and just go back. I put a card down. There's a bit of ink on the folder. Of the six you've seen, just on white cardstock, as we were saying. So this one is Blossom Bunch you're going to see uh, first of all. There's your sunflower. And again, the positioning of these, I know they could be a big sit under there, you could cut it there, of course. You could be going off, off screen, I was almost going to say. The boxed in is just so superior, isn't it? Geometric leaves, as you can see there. Uh, the wicker uh, basket, whichever way around you put it, which is just divine. And the very first one is your lollipops or your roses. So, let's ping through them individually. If you want to get them individually or all together, the collective is in the uh, pick and mix. So there's your wicker basket, of which 35% of the wicker basket has sold out individually. The sunflower, my personal favourite, I just think it's really striking, one of the biggest solo designs. One third of the sunflower has sold out. Uh, the lollipop, that rosy one I was talking about, 35% of the lollipop has now gone. And your geometric leaves heading towards two thirds of the stock. Congratulations, everybody. Goodness me. Uh, the boxing is now in the lead on this show. Oh, wow. oh, where did those come from? Thanks. There we go. A third of the boxing now. It was at 20%. It was the very first one we showed you at the start of the show. It's now 35. I don't sure you can see there, but you see them on the end of the cast that we were talking about. Uh, there's your blossom bunch, which is now 35%. So a lot of you are already making up your minds. The best value, of course, is going for the pick and mix for 12, 14 on flexi pay. Last call for your embossing powders. Last call for the the pinky, orangey, terracotta, -y, pottery, sunsetty ones. Sounds that right, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, look at those lights in the background there. Huh? Great photography, that Andre did that. Did he? Yeah. Is it? Well, my team, yeah. Is it? Of course. Of course, of course, of course. Yeah, you're right. Well, so you expect anything else? <laughs> Uh, five nine two two three five. I was about to do it. Uh, limited stock. Uh, limited <laughs> stock. Congratulations, everybody. Only eleven sixty nine. So clearly, I'm going to be here in the morning or by the end of this show. You can get hold of yours. Shall we now start a demo then? Can I just show you the demo I did earlier? Of course. So that's the one where oh, I told you. you about doing two and layering them up with Ooh, the oh, um, sorry. gold, gold gilding wax. Not gilding. Gild the these gold waxes. Gilding yeah, gilding waxes. waxes. That's it. Gold, gold and in, this is the Cadence one, which is on the website, but you can see that. Add a little bit of watercolour in the back, background. Has some gossip car stock coming into play here yeah, as well, and then, absolutely adore. Yeah, and then just your pads underneath and raise it up. Absolutely gorgeous. So just think outside the box as well. Right, so I'm just going to quickly run Geo leaves through. Okay. Because this is part of the technique. So again... Is somewhere or should I stand it up? Yeah, just stand it over there. Thanks, okay, darling. Okay, sure. So I'll just run this one through and then I just want to show you, because this is going to be my background and I'm going to leave this solely white. Now earlier I showed you a few inky techniques, didn't I? But this time we're going to go back to a little bit of simplicity. Really, okay. really easy. So that is, as you've just seen me do on with Dan, is it just run through. Beautiful detail. Absolutely gorgeous. So this is just a scrap one that I've just done with Dan. So I just wanted to show you that if you look at the pattern, you can cut this flower away here. 
Just simply just take your scissors. Oh, I suppose much like the blossom bunch, yeah. much like the sunflower, for example. Of course. So, you know. <coughs> so, when you've done a rough one, just go round and you can absolutely just take out. Now, because they're inexpensive, you imagine how much it would cost to create a dye that did this for you. Mm. In the current market, it will be extortionate and custom. And yeah, really, all that dye's doing is because crafters just wouldn't pay it. I wouldn't outside. pay it. Yeah. So this is giving you that 3D emboss with the capability to snip into it if you want to. Now there are embossing folders that do have dyes incorporated, some glued in, some not glued in. But I just think this is an easier one just to do yourself. Mm -hmm. So you don't want to see me cut it all out, but you get the idea. So you just go all the way around there. Yep. And that gives. Can I just move this mess over to that side? Do whatever you want. Can I just if give I can you help. that? Thank you, Dom. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So let's just put that to one side, and I've already got some cut. So here's one cut. Very simply. Can you see? Just from there like that. Yeah. How cool does that look? Dimensional. It looks like I've used the dice. Absolutely not. And then here's one with a little bit of sparkle as well. So when you come to lay them up, look how gorgeous oh, it is. Lovely. So let's get a quick card made. So when you look at this, it's a card, it's literally nothing. So we've got a card blank, which everybody has in a stash. We have a little bit of coloured card. Now I've gone for green mm -hmm. because every time I do a card, I always do pinks and purples and I'm trying to step away from pinks and purples. So try and use a colour that you don't yeah. always use if you can. Well, you've nailed it on this one, eh? <laughs> So I'll just pop There's that down there. a bit of pink and purple glitter in there. Yeah, the way, you know, I've got to have that sparkle, haven't we? Okay. And then we have our lovely... I like how our rules work for one thing to work, <laughs> for right? one thing and not the yeah, other. Yeah, but that's okay. It's not that's that bit. Okay. It's not that bit, yeah. And then we have you our lovely... You can hear lovely it when the glue, the tip is going over the back of the embossing folder, can't you? The detail. detail. Back on there. Now that's just a card in itself, isn't it? So then all we're going to do here is let's pop... Let's give these a little bit of a pinch. So this will could be a great poinsettia if you did it in red. Oh, what a great shout that is. Let's pop that on there. And then let's pop this one on top with a sparkle on. You can pop a, a gem in the centre or sparkles if you wanted to. And then we have one sentiment, which is I'm on. This is using that lovely green um, embossing powder from the lovely summer collection. And this is where the embossing folder is doing absolutely all of the talking. I'm not even going to add anything else. It does need a gem in the middle. There we go. But you could absolutely layer that flower up. There you go. That is one of six new embossing folders for you. It's called Geometric Leaves. If you want to do exactly... And this is the point of why we do live demonstrations and more than ever because I could copy that exactly. You I'm not sure what to do. I've never done it before. I'll copy that exactly. The only thing I did there was cut those flowers ahead of time and that would took me a couple of minutes. Yep. So you could absolutely replicate that. We've had a sellout. Guess what it is? The wow powders. Congratulations, everybody. You've got well the done. other three as well. Uh, you've got the pink. Thank you, Tony. I'll let you reset. Okay. Uh, you've still got the other embossing folders, by the way. Uh, the pink side of things. Uh, the pink one. Uh, which is Hello Summer, Summer Loving, and some of that is pink, purple, and green uh, for you. Uh, there it is on the screen for you right now, 385187. That's 1169 in the club. But what are you going to go for in the pick and mix? Here's a deal for you. If you wish, it's just gone half past eight. Thank you so much for joining us live uh, this is it Tuesday, Bernie. It's Tuesday, it's Tuesday radio. Because six new folders, and you can go individually, pick and choose, whatever you wish to do, 999, 999, 999, etc., etc., gets you to nearly £30, doesn't it? Individual item numbers, individual PMPs, if that's what you're doing. So, we then put them on a pick and mix for you, which means we can do one PMP of only 299 reduce the price of each of them by nearly £2, and put FlexiPay on there as well. One item number, 744197. Which ones do you want to go for? I'll fly through them. Lollipops, geometric leaves and box in. Sunflower wicker basket, blossom bunch. I don't expect you to remember to write those down. That's why I direct you to go to the website, creatingcraft.com, where you can see all pictures and all names going next to them all. But definitely put three in. If you put two in, it's the same price. So let's make sure we pop three in. If you want all six, you pop all six in that same basket, and it'll be 24 28 on FlexiPay, but still only one PMP. Now, the wicker basket, which is right down there uh, at the front, half the stock of the wicker basket is gone. Just to put it in perspective, at the start of the show, that was 30%. Now it's 50% of the stock's gone uh, for you. Much like the lollipops at the top, 
Uh, the lollipops is now 50% gone as well. Lots of different ideas, but as Tony beautifully pointed out, you haven't got to, if you haven't got all the inks or the, or the or the powders or the waxes or the flakes or whatever we're talking about, you could just you could do it onto craft cards, couldn't you? And rub it back a little bit onto black if there's a, a white core or a black core. There's still all the sorts of finishes, but that's called uh, lollipops. 50% there has sold out and gone. Oh, the Geo leaves. Tony heard that before I even said it. 70% of the stock has gone. That is on track to be the first sellout of the six, and then you can still get it, but it's part of the individual. So if you want it part of your pick and mix, and basically save two pounds off, it's not an exact science, it's a little bit less, um, but and add a PMP, uh, that is 70% gone, Four seven seven one nine seven. What are you going for? Individuals, pick and mix. Don't forget the remaining wow powders, I think we've actually used all those, and all of those other stamps on the website, crateandcraft.com, including the Eureka, that's on three flexis. Want to know more about that once you check out? Here you go. Flexi Buy. It's as simple as shop, click, and craft. Buy it today. Spread your payment at no extra cost. There are no fees, no interest, and no waiting. So whether you're potty on paper craft, mad on mixed media, or just starting your sewing journey, Shopping has never been easier. It's time to buy what you want, when you want. With two, three, or even four interest-free Flexi Buys. Shop today with Flexi Buy on Create and Craft. Ah, now was it Summer Heights you mentioned? Yes, I'm just going to quickly stamp it and die cut it, is that okay? Yes, so I'm going to use it as part of my demo. So the Summer Heights is this fabulous, fabulous stamp and die set. So you can see you get the beautiful floral in there. It's very summer-esque. It's got the beautiful basket, some lovely sentiments, and the two beautiful kites which have all of these lovely coordinating outline dies as well. You have the QR code on the back, don't forget that as well, that's going to take mm -hmm. you to all the inspiration from last time I was here with these. And this is the one that I'm going to incorporate in with well, our are, lovely are the other stamps in there? Um, in, in the same one, which, no, which sorry, is in, in the, the bundle. Actually in the packaging, because I know you prep and stuff beforehand. All right, so I was just going to read the sentiments, that's all, while you're demonstrating. You can, can you read them? Yeah, I can read them. They're not too messy. Right, so let's stamp yeah, this maybe. one out. <laughs> Be patient and trust your journey. Yep. Home is not a place, it's a feeling. What a sentiment is that? Home is not a place, it's, it's a, a feeling. feeling. Isn't it? Enjoy. Is it enjoy this day? Enjoy this day, yeah. That's a lovely way of putting it. Enjoy this day. Yeah, change it up a bit. Yeah. So I'm just stamping this out in black. And this is where you're going to see all of that lovely detail. I'm using my Eureka, so if I miss any parts, I can go back in and fix it. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. Now I can watercolour again, take myself off. Just enjoy this. Can I give yep. you this stamp to stick on there? Okay, hang on. Grab it. Right, I've got it. I've got it. He's on it. Okay, on it. so I'm it. just going to show you how the lovely die cut works. I'm not going to spend too much time on this because I appreciate a lot of people, the, the embossing folders. You can folders. this in there, which doesn't come with it. Oh, that's part. Look at you. You're covered in ink. Do, don't touch me. <laughs> don't touch me. Don't it's touch me. Oh, you sound like, you sound like every girlfriend I've ever had, Tony. <laughs> Just pop it on camera and sit with it. Oh, that's fine. It didn't come in this dice set. That's fine. It that's goes it. in the other one. That's all. Don't okay. panic. Don't panic. <laughs> and I do always... Are you like that, like me? Like, that stamp doesn't go in there. Put it back where it was. Yeah. The thing is, as well, though, I always think our packaging is eco-friendly yep. and it's so, so durable. And we also give you inspiration on the front with cards, finished cards, and you've got that QR code on there. So I always say, don't... Te don't like decant our stamps out of that lovely packaging. I pay extra for you to get that, so you've got a visual. Yep. So when you are absolutely flicking through your products, you think, "Oh yeah, I remember that hot air balloon. That's yep. a lovely stamp. I'm going to use it." Because when they're in magnetic sheets and put in a drawer, you forget about them. Stamps where they're in clear sheets, it's like I've got no, I've got no capability to be inspirational. Think what I can do with it. But that image on there gets me going straight away. Completely agree. All the different sentiments, there's plenty on there. And there's a little QR code on the back as all the packaging does. Uh, details on the screen and the dies are in there too, the ones that need cutting out, 466961. Okay, you're on. Thank you. Could I have um, my, just this mat please? <laughs> Can I have my stamps and dies back please? <laughs> so I'll I'm just going to, thank you, I'm just going to run this one through. So this is a die now, so I'm just changing my plates, pop this on, and we just run. Now I'll just run this one through. I just wanted to show you this because it is really, really beautiful. And the, and the die cuts all of the recesses in within the, the like the ropes on the um, on the hot air balloon as well, which is lovely. So when you pop it out, you pop out all of the elements looking here, 
and you end up with the most gorgeous hot air balloon, which is stunning. Little to no effort, you don't have to have, yeah, to yeah, have yeah. any colour or it's anything very, like that. It's very fantastical and adventurous, yeah. isn't it? So here is one I just added a bit of grey and a bit of sparkle to. Hopefully you'll be able to see that there. So I didn't want too much colour on this card. I want to just have it very, very subtle, like it's got a bit of shading in there. So let's put the card together. So let's just move that for now. And let's bring it in this embossing folder. Can we put that back in the packet? Yes, please. If you want, yeah. Can you be trusted? Well, we'll find out. So I'm going to use the embossing folder this time, and I'm going to use that lovely creeping blossom effect design, which can be used landscape, portrait, top, corner. You can use this on a corner piece of card. So if you use a bigger piece of card, like an A4 or an 8x8, you could absolutely create a corner embellishment if you wanted to. There are, I don't think there's any rules at all. Mm -hmm. So let's... Oh. Boom. Let's just pop this one through. I've been set a task, haven't I, Tony? Which one are you looking for? The one, the geometric leaves with the pink cut-out flower? Is that the one? Pink with a background. pink background, which might be this might one. Might be that one. Because Alison has emailed... Is it this one, Alison? I hope it is. If not, you've got time. Oh, email back in. I'm, I think it might be the embossing one, pink background. Oh. Boxed in for the embossing powders. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Keep going. This so one? That one. Yeah, so well, let's uh, let's explain let's both. We just demoed this one pretty much, haven't we? Yep. So basically, it's got a vellum wrap and a sentiment on there. Super easy. And there's just one flower with some sparkle on, sparkle pencil and Karen. And then this one, it's run through the embossing folder. And then what they've done is they've run a sticky ink pad, you know, your clear sticky ink pad, which is this one. Yep. Just run it over the top lightly, sprinkle your powder on, dust it off and heat set it. And you get this mockled sort of reflective design in there. Very super, very super cool. easy. You can actually use your sticky ink pad inside your embossing folder, ink up the embossing folder, run that through if you want yep. to. Just bear in mind though that when you come to use your embossing folder for the second time, it might still be a little bit sticky, so maybe just give it a, a clean straight after, but you can use your sticky embossing powder for this. Alison, if that's answered your question, Hopefully. it's brilliant news. If it hasn't, If not, PM, PM me. P just PM me, it's fine. I'll, yep. I'll talk you through it. You, you, can, you, can, you can email me now if you want to, or just go straight to Tony, or she can, what do you want? So yeah. there is that white one, you can see the drenched, <laughs> you can see the detail in there, it's just absolutely stunning. So what I wanted to do Ooh. with this card is show you that although <laughs> this is like a flower, yeah. and it's beautiful, it doesn't have to be used as the focus, it can be just an accent in the back of our card. So let's just bring this in here. So with our embossing folder here, I've just mm -hmm. got an off cut of um, mirror board here, and I'm just going to add a little touch down one side. Do you find a presenter next to you? Helpful or it depends because <laughs> you do so much on your channels and on your social media. No, I actually, um, I actually know how difficult it is trying to do it myself. It's really hard, it is really, you really, really yeah, well, I won't say so, but <laughs> you know, it is really, really difficult, you know, making sure you um, I interactive and questions and understanding products. It's not just about standing here with a smiley face. As much as people may think it is, it's absolutely not. It's, it's really, really difficult. Oh, <laughs> but um, yeah, I find it really helpful. And by the way, if you love what Tony does and her range and everything about Stamps by Me, do vote for Tony in the Craft Awards, by oh, the way. Yeah. Do vote. You're, you're, uh, and you uh, yeah, you got some awards last year as well, didn't you? Yeah, so we've won Most Love Stamping range for two years mm -hmm. on the trot, which is amazing. But this year, we're up for that uh, category again, but we're up for so many others. It's like best website. We have spent a lot of money on our website to give uh, our customers a better experience, but yeah, it's amazing really, I can't believe it. E every year it's like... Oh, so I remember... And you've been... I remember earlier. years ago when you, hadn't, you hadn't, when you first got nominated, and you were buzzing, and you're buzzing as much now. Yeah, I've got, I think I've been nominated in eight, then five, then five, and then this time six. Simon's in from Avago Inc. Yes, Which yes, is yes, amazing. Yes. Really cool. So, so, so cool. whoever you want to vote for, uh, you can go find yeah, the Craft Beautiful Awards. Go and vote for your fave. Uh, and vote for your fave. But if you don't, if you don't know who to vote for, you know, you can vote for anyone. <laughs> what you like. So oh. I've put that lovely strip of mirror board behind there just to add like an accent on this card. You'll see here. <laughs> and I've got, I'm, again, I'm mounting white on white here because I think it just looks awesome. I mean, come on. That's a cool little. Just an accent down one yeah. side. Yeah. Yeah. And then all I'm going to do border. here is I'm just going to take some pads. I absolutely love the florals, but I can't do florals all the time. I'm told. I get told. You can't do florals all the time. But you know what? I know a lot of people turn to you for florals. And I like, you do lots of different orientations of which, like, 
the bunch, for example, or the big sunflower could have been a, a smaller group, couldn't it? Or Absolutely, a, a, and don't a, be you, scared. You change it up. Yeah, and don't be see it like, can I just, can you just, um, what? let's just show you something here. Don't be scared to, oh, let me just show you. I know mid, mid um, demo here, which is a bit crazy. So when you've um, cut, put it through your embossing folder, which is often look, don't be scared to cut <gasps> straight in half and then cut around here and have half of a sunflower oh, lovely. on a card. Don't be, a, don't be afraid to put like half a sunflower on a card, plus you cut around, maybe put half this side and half that side, just because it's on the embossing folder as an entity. Don't be afraid to cut it up into segments that. and that, because it's really, really beautiful. However you want to hack it up and cut it up, yeah, yeah, yeah. it is really, really beautiful. Um, if you love all things sunflowers, the next hour, uh, your one day special from Forever Flowers is all about the uh, <laughs> sunflowers. Yeah, it's like a full florist over there, isn't it? Uh, so if you love this kind of thing, it's coming up next live with Sarah. Yeah, the new one she's got on today, I'm like, that looks so real. She's like, I know, it's Incredible, great. It? Honestly, so real. So I've just uh, got she's full of energy. Pads. She's eating loads of knickknacks, isn't she? <laughs> she's like, I don't normally eat chocolate. <laughs> Double decker. <laughs> just got oh. in one. In one. <laughs> Incredible. So I'm just <laughs> mounting this onto here with some pads. Now, again, just because it's been designed so it looks like that on your embossing folder, don't be afraid maybe to pop it so it's up at the top corner. There's simply no rules. So I'm just going to go with how I've created it well on it this piece. It could be um, a landscape card as well, couldn't it? Yeah, of course it could. Like Sentiment. Beautiful. Sorry. Oh. And then I'm going to bring in our lovely hot air balloon. Uh -huh. and I'm going to add some pads on here again. Now this is to show you that, um, you know, although it's got a massive accent in the background with that lovely embossing folder, this hot air balloon is now going to push that detail back and I'm just going to have it creeping over one side. Does that make sense? So so that could have... I can't so much read through you, could have um, with deepest sympathy or thinking of you, couldn't that it? I think it's, it's done, really, it? really it's thoughtful, isn't it? It's absolutely done, isn't it? You do not need if you don't want to, but that's what's cool about them is if you do want to, you have the capability to do both. Yep. You're not put in a box. Yep. So here we have our lovely um, hot air balloon and I'm just going to pop it over here so let's move it over a little bit let's just have it creeping around that embossing and then all it needs is a sentiment which is in my um half the stock is it this one laura half the stock of Where's blossom bunch bunch has sold out half now so my sentiment's gone unfortunately but oh no is that the one i stashed away into the um, packet maybe it might be mightn't it so anyway don't need to fear don't you know, so let's just lean that forward so you can see the detail, hopefully. But you can see it's added that lovely accent around the colour the the colour of the balloon if you want to. That would have looked that hot air balloon would have looked incredible on the box in, on the lollipop. <gasps> the waves that the could be waves like, like yeah. it's going over the sea. You've got kites in that stamp set as well. So you know, try not to look at things as they are interpreted on the packet. If you're doing something that makes you happy, it makes me happy. So if you can be happy to go on the website, creatingcraft.com, that's where you go to this show page. You can go to the show, what, like live, for example, what's on air right now. There are all the individuals. Tony, come with me if you're free. Okay. Uh, this is where you can see all the individuals. So nine nine if that's your budget this month and you like something new to land on your doorstep, absolutely. You're in the club, of course. Eight ninety nine uh, is your club price. Um, but if you can go for £12.14, pence, that's your first flexi pay, uh, plus your same P&P of £2.99, and you're going to get three. Speaking of three... Uh, you can also get the, um, the Eureka of three flexi pays as well uh, for you, so that's available. And those wows, the finishing uh, stock of the wows, is on this show today. And do have a scroll down to the rest of the dies and the stencils and the stamps, etc. And your deal of the day, which is watercolour cardstock, which feels very apt as you are in the building, Tony. Uh, there it is for <laughs> you, uh, 019608. I'll show you that later on. And buy one free six pence. Pence is still there. Should we look at more samples here? Because I think it was so interesting, in fact. Oh, where are they? The white ones. Look where they've gone now. I should have brought them over. Sorry. So it's the right over. I know. Oh, it's, too, it's too far. It's is, right. Do you not get your steps in? I'll pop. So pick a mix. You can pick any three you want to. You choose. They haven't been put in a box for you, so you can use them as entities on their own or equally. Don't if you be too buy good, the Tony, three, I need a job. you can pick the three that you absolutely love. I haven't picked them for you. You can choose the ones that you want. So we have boxed in. We have your geo florals. She's good, we isn't have she? lollipops. We have sunflowers. We have the wicker basket, on, and we also have Blossom Bunch. Goodbye. That's the end of the show. <laughs> right.
I'm going to show you um, the white. Yeah, if you want to have a sample, uh, well, you we can. Here we go. Go team. Uh, so you get the idea of just putting it through your. As long as the die cut machine's as big as the folder, away you go. So your mid range is upright. So you can see entity on square or circle. Watercolored. I mean, that just looks wow, and it's got dimension. And really then what about being a little bit crazy with your background and your texture? Add a white gel pen, and then add Penny, some. I'll move on to boxing now. Okay. Just, uh, just testing you. Boxing. Here we go. Boxing. You get the idea of that, that quilted look that um, I think producer Laura said earlier on. Absolutely, it's divine, isn't it's it? It's absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? I don't know how you're going to decide. Hence the reason why I've put the pick and mix on for you, so you don't have to decide. Go and pick the ones that you know you'll use. Please use them. That's why we buy them. There we go. Right. I'll bring these over here, and I'm going to go to the lollipop. Ta-da! Here we go. If you, ever if you ever do work experience at your studio, Tony, give me a nod, yeah. <laughs> I'll give it a go. Don't be ridiculous. Here we go. Yeah, just to practice and see how it's done. Yeah, just waiting. To <laughs> there you go. You see that? Yeah, do you see that? <laughs> see that? Great. Equally, check out social media. All our design team post all of their yes. makes in the run up to the show to show you all. Wicker basket. Wicker basket. Can you see them? Have I hidden them from you? Have I? Have we not got any? Sorry about you. Where have I put them? So that's that. <laughs> so that's that. Which one haven't I done? Oh, the, the wicker um, basket the and then the geometric floor. There's the wicker basket. Here look. we go. Wicker basket. Here we go. We got it. Bravo. Terrible. Bless cameras. Sorry, Taz. That's the wicker basket. And then we have geoflorals. And I'll love this. love this one. Be inspired. Look at that. Jew. This is now three quarters of the stock sold out. So tonight in the gap between this show and Millsop coming up next, that's when you pop it in your basket and press check out. I want you to have all six options and that's what you get tonight right rather than five rather than four etc 744197 for you tony thank you so much great show um great show well done you i would say it's getting better but you've got martin in the morning so martin parker yeah that's him that's not okay. the other martin that's okay yeah good eight o'clock eight o'clock see you then all right cheerio i'll see you then